Mass readings for Monday, May 20, 2024. Memorial of the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of the Church. Lectionary, 572a. First reading, Genesis 3, verses 9 to 15 and 20 or Acts 1, verses 12 to 14. And the Lord God called Adam and said to him, Where art thou? And he said, I heard thy voice in paradise, and I was afraid, because I was naked, and I hid myself. And he said to him, And who hath told thee that thou wast naked, but that thou hast eaten of the tree whereof I commanded thee that thou shouldst not eat? And Adam said, The woman, whom thou gavest me to be my companion, gave me of the tree, and I did eat. And the Lord God said to the woman, Why hast thou done this? And she answered, The serpent deceived me, and I did eat. And the Lord God said to the serpent, Because thou hast done this thing, thou art cursed among all cattle, and beasts of the earth, upon thy breast shalt thou go, and earth shalt thou eat all the days of thy life. I will put enmities between thee and the woman, and thy seed and her seed, she shall crush thy head, and thou shalt lie in wait for her heel. And Adam called the name of his wife Eve, because she was the mother of all the living. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Or. Then they returned to Jerusalem from the mount that is called Olivet, which is nigh Jerusalem, within a Sabbath day's journey. And when they were come in, they went up into an upper room, where abode Peter and John, James and Andrew, Philip and Thomas, Bartholomew and Matthew, James of Alphaeus, and Simon Zelotes, and Jude the brother of James. All these were persevering with one mind in prayer with the women, and Mary the mother of Jesus, and with his brethren. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Responsorial Psalm. Response. Glorious things are told of you, O city of God. For the sons of Kor, a psalm of a canticle. The foundations thereof are in the holy mountains. The Lord loveth the gates of Shaun above all the tabernacles of Jacob. Response, glorious things are told of you, O city of God. Glorious things are said of thee, O city of God. Shall not Shaun say, this man and that man is born in her? And the highest himself hath founded her. Response, glorious things are told of you, O city of God. The Lord shall tell in his writings of peoples and of princes, of them that have been in her. The dwelling in thee is as it were of all rejoicing. Response, glorious things are told of you, O city of God. Alleluia. 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 O happy virgin, you gave birth to the Lord, O blessed mother of the church, you warm our hearts with the spirit of your son Jesus Christ. Alleluia, Alleluia. Gospel, John 19, verses 25 to 34. Now there stood by the cross of Jesus, his mother, and his mother's sister, Mary of Cleophas, and Mary Magdalene. When Jesus therefore had seen his mother and the disciple standing whom he loved, he saith to his mother, Woman, behold thy son. After that, he saith to the disciple, Behold thy mother. And from that hour, the disciple took her to his own. Afterwards, Jesus knowing that all things were now accomplished, that the scripture might be fulfilled, said, I thirst. Now there was a vessel set there full of vinegar. And they, putting a sponge full of vinegar and hyssop, put it to his mouth. Jesus therefore, when he had taken the vinegar, said, It is consummated. And bowing his head, he gave up the ghost. Then the Jews, because it was the perceive, that the bodies might not remain on the cross on the Sabbath day, for that was a great Sabbath day, besought Pilate that their legs might be broken, and that they might be taken away. The soldiers therefore came, and they broke the legs of the first, and of the other that was crucified with him. 
But after they were come to Jesus, when they saw that he was already dead, they did not break his legs. But one of the soldiers with a spear opened his side, and immediately there came out blood and water. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ.